when you're flying into somewhere you like playing in, you yeah. get a smile on your face, you get this confidence going, you know that you're going to have good results. Same thing for a pitcher on the mound as is for a hitter in the box, and Ian loves hitting here. This one drilled right field. Yeah, he likes hitting here all right. Way out of here. And Hat lift off his 14th, and it is 1 0 Cubs. Yeah, he likes it. And that was crushed. It's going to go back in the dugout and says, hey, listen, I don't know what you guys are going to do after this, but I'm going to stay right here in Cincinnati. Gets a 3-1 fastball, absolutely tattoos it. Says, see, Taylor, I, I told you, I love hitting here. I don't know if it's the backdrop or whatever it is, but he does not miss as an absolute no-doubter. Comebacker. Andy, a sliding pick, pops up, the throw is there. Well, flash the leather, if you will, Andy. That's a great play. That one flared out into center. Falling falls for a hit. Chirinos around third on his way to the plate. He will score. And it is 4 nothing. An embarrassment of riches here in the early going. We talked about Ortega. He's just been hot and his ability to have good at bats. Just missed a pitch in the first inning flying out to right field and we said it last night it's not sometimes how hard you hit it it's where you hit it fights a tough pitch on the inside part of the plate off and is able to drop it into center field and put the Cubs up for nothing. Chirinos getting a good jump and able to score. Ortega continues to stay hot got the oven mitt on and Schwindel up here. That one drilled out towards center field. That's going to touch down and roll all the way to the fence. Here comes Ortega around third. Ortega to the plate. Schwindel into second. And the Cubs lead it five to nothing. And Frank Schwindel continues his torrid pace. Wasting no time once again. He loves that first pitch. He's hunting fastball. Any breaking ball that spins up in the zone, he's ready to hit this. And He's absolutely on a tear right now. Seventh straight game with an extra base hit. Crushing this first pitch cement mixer that floats in the middle of the plate for a double. And so 5 nothing Cubs. It's his second seven game hit streak of the season. Before this year he'd only done that once. And before this streak he was well below 200 for about a month. And found himself in a long slump with more limited playing time. Ortega slows gone to the netting atop the home bullpen. The renaissance of the Reds, Tyler Naquin reaches new heights. Well, many of the hits that we've seen from Tyler Naquin as of late have been up the middle, other way. And at this time, really stand behind the baseball, putting a charge in it. Plenty of power. Step in development. Jeff Hoffman on here. Pitching change brought to you by Lakeside Bank. That's hit pretty well right field. Way back there and gone. From one Alcantara to another. Sergio goes yard. His third. And it's 6-1. is the thing they know he'll do that's catching this one butted first base side everybody's safe run is in and the Cubs add one more single RBI seven check swing did he go yes he did struck him out ball game and the Cubs 